This is Josh Sibley with the head scout from Louisiana Great Iron Football. Here with Cam McQuinn, uh, athlete from Iota High School. So, Cam, uh, tell me about yourself. Well, um, I'm a free safety. I was auditioning this year at safety. But I'm here for quarterback because I was the guy my sophomore year. I believe that I can be a good quarterback and I will. I will step up, and uh, my dad, he uh, he coaches. He's been coaching his my my whole life. Uh, I've been around him my whole life. It's it's what I do. It's what I like to do. It's fun for me. I, I love the uh, competition. I like to hit people. I like to run. I like to be the guy. You know, I like to I like the swag. It's fun. So, uh, your past couple seasons, how how, how have they gone? Well, my uh, my first two years at IOTA, we were one and nine and two and eight. This past year, we went nine and three, uh, second round of the playoffs. Had a few guys go all state. Uh, I was a junior. I didn't uh, play quarterback this past year. I was at free safety, mm -hmm. and uh, one of our better seasons this past year mm -hmm. went to the second round. Uh, lost to Kaplan, team we could have beaten. Um, Offense wasn't there. Couldn't have stopped their offense. Could have been, definitely could have been a, a state team. Mm -hmm. uh, I feel like this year we're going to come back and try to do that. Okay. Um, tell me about uh, your accolades in the uh, in the district at uh, free safety and quarterback. Uh, free safety, I was uh, all district this year. Mm -hmm. um, my sophomore year, I did um, I did start. The third game of the season, mm -hmm. our first first string got hurt. Uh, it was a better season than my freshman year. Mm -hmm. You know, I, I feel like I brought us to our first few wins. We went two and eight that year. Um, I got our first homecoming win against Lake Arthur. That's great. I believe they were eight and two that year. Uh, first homecoming win in six seven years maybe. Mm -hmm. I threw for two hundred yards. And you know that's pretty decent for the run game we have mm -hmm. and have had for the past four years now. But uh, yeah, it was it was one of our better seasons. You know, it led up to the season we had this past year. Okay. My sophomore year, I got thrown in. You know, went toe to toe with two good teams in a two A, Welsh and Kinder. Uh, very close games at half. We just fell apart in the second half defensively against Welsh. And uh, that's when they t took over. But we're there. We were there. Mm -hmm. And that's that's what we believe in. You were also uh, uh, the number three safety in uh, South Central Louisiana, right? Yes, sir. I was uh, listed at number three in Southwest or Louisiana. Southwest. Okay. Yes, sir. Any predictions for this season? Uh, this season, um, we're going to be tough. We're going to be probably just as good as last year. Mm -hmm. But we're not going to make the mistakes we made last year. We got a lot of starters coming back. Uh, we're gonna be fine. We just got to stay the course. You know, we can't change anything up because mm -hmm. we do the things that we do, and we do them. We do them good. Mm -hmm. When we do that, we're gonna be successful, and that's what we know. So we're not gonna stop. Tell me about your training that you've uh, done this off season. I heard you gotten faster yes, since sir. last year. Uh, yes, sir. Um, my sophomore year, I, I ran a, a four seven four eight. Mm -hmm. uh, we got a guy that came in. A coach, Coach Keltner, came in and uh, helped us last summer. Got me to a four six flat, and then uh, they were stunned when they seen four six zero. Mm -hmm. So we, I ran it again, and I ran the same thing, two clocks. Uh, he's helped us for sure. Mm -hmm. He's helped us get stronger, faster, more mobile, and that's a, probably a big factor of why we went nine and three. Mm -hmm. is it, and uh, how is that regimen? Uh, is that just um you in the weight room? Or are you on the track? Or how's that schedule? Um, both. Well, we lifted two days a week, mm -hmm. and we were on the track a lot of the time. Mm -hmm. Probably the same amount of time as practice. You know, it's very important, and we realize that now. So we're going to trust it more. Mm -hmm. uh, being on the track, mobility, um, sprints. You know, it all helps. You know, it's the reason we were fast. So you're a um, a two sport athlete. Tell me about. Uh, tell me some of your uh, baseball uh, accolades. Uh, this past year, I was a 
second team all district. You know, I, I think I should have been first team. <laughs> uh, but no, the first team guy was, he was good. Uh, I give it to him. But uh, we were we were a good team this year. We went to the state finals, fell short, but we're going to be right back. It's, we know what it takes. We're going to use whatever we can this year. It's going to be fun. How was your overall record this year? We went 33-7. and seven. Um, The senior class that graduated, when they were freshmen, they were 4-24. and 24. So it's the same as football. You know, we turned it around. It was it's great to be a part of. But yeah, we went 33-7, and seven, something a lot of people did not expect. You know, we feel we kind of prioritized on the map by doing that. So we're going to try to do the same thing next year. <laughs> so, so from last year to this year, you went... What was it, 4 and 4 and 4? It was 4 and 24. Oh, 4 and 24. That was three years ago. Oh, three years ago. Okay, my mistake. So. Last year, um, we, we went, we had a losing record, mm -hmm. 12 and 15. And then, uh, you know, we, we knew we were good. Mm -hmm. We uh, we had the athletes. But, um, we knew we just had to step it up and find it. Mm -hmm. So we, we kind of fine-tuned a lot of things this past fall, summer. We worked a lot harder. Mm -hmm. And I feel like that's what got us where we are. So since you've been at IOTA, all the sports you played at, their overall records have improved drastically. Yes, sir. What do you bring to a college? I, I, I believe I can bring some wins. Uh, a kid that won't give up. I mean, he's going he's gonna to try. His, I'm going to try my best in everything I do, whether it's free safety, quarterback, pitcher. I believe I give it my all. And... You're not going to get anything less. Mm -hmm. Finished this year with a 3.2. Last year was 3.1. Mm -hmm. uh, that's another thing for sure. I'm, I'm going to do my work to make sure that I'm still able to play sports. Mm -hmm. I feel like it's very important. Mm -hmm. So, do you think uh, playing sports makes you a better student? Yes, sir. Keeps me out of trouble. Mm -hmm. And, you know, that's anyone. They have more busy, more busy work. Mm -hmm more stuff to focus on other than parties and all that. I feel like it's important. Okay. So uh, tell me what you love about football. I love being the guy. Uh, I love the Friday night feeling, all the hard work you put in during the week, during the fall, during the summer. It. Uh, I love the challenge. Mm -hmm. I love uh, competition. You know, you're trying to get – Farther than them, you're trying to be better than the other team, no matter who it is. Yeah, that's what I love about it. How did it feel when you found out you were going to be in our magazine? Uh, when I found out I was going to be in the magazine, I thought, well, I mean, it was a great feeling. I didn't expect it, but now that I'm in it, and I feel like I deserved it. Absolutely. Now that I think about it. Yes, sir. How does it feel to be uh, named to a uh, Louisiana Rare Iron Football All Star Bowl game. Uh, it's it's great. You know I worked hard for it. Mm -hmm. uh, all the work is it's gonna pay off when I get to do that, and I'm really excited. Mm -hmm. I want to like I'm gonna do big things in that game, mm -hmm. and I feel like I'm gonna shine and get to bring some of my boys from Iota with me too. It's gonna be fun. If you like this interview, uh, go ahead and subscribe below. If you want to read more about Ken and other athletes from the state of Louisiana. Please subscribe to the magazine, uh, LouisianaGridironFootball.com. Thank you. Thank you, Ken.